Okay, so this is a Yale Time expired. Uh, touch screen that was made uh, from Yale with a module AT&T module, which doesn't change anything. So it's brand new, I just plug it. So when you're asking you to register to the master continue. code, so let's let's do that first. Register master code. Press the pound key to continue. Enter a four to eight digit pin code. Registered. So now the the lock is registered. So now we're gonna integrate it in the home automation. So I am using the home automation Vera Z Wave. So we're going to add the device. So first you need to put the locks in inclusion mode. So now it's turning. So we're going to do the code that you have registered before. Then you're going to do menu mode. Menu mode. Number. Press the pound key to continue. So you do the seven. Wireless module setting mode. Press the pound key to continue. Join the wireless network. Press so you the join the wireless network. Join the wireless network. Then you pound. Pre so now it's in inclusion mode. So now the Vera and I'm gonna add the device. I'm gonna put. Um, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna door lock. Then I'm gonna select why I did 220, for instance. And now I need to do what's there. So I redo it again on the device because it, it times out. Menu mode. Enter number. Wireless mod. Join the join the wireless network. So now and then it say here device detected. Completed. Completed. You heard. So I'm successful. So now the thing is added to the network. So I go to next, next. I guess I don't need to do that anymore. I'm just gonna exit it. I guess it's gonna be there. Uh, let's wait a little bit. It says, please wait. So is here configuring Z-Wave device in the system. So you see now you can see it here. So the touch screen is there now. And I just gonna press it, you're gonna I'm gonna press the button. So you're gonna I'm not gonna press from the lock, but I'm gonna press from the the controller. It's gonna send the command, you see? You can see the locks. Uh, getting a command, so now it's locked. I guess I'm gonna unlock it by pressing it. So I'm doing it here. It's unlocked, and then I click here, and then it's locking the thing. So everything good and working.